Finally tonight, a historic moment in the sky. NASA's Artemis 1 blasted off early this morning on an unmanned mission to orbit the moon. CBS's Mark Strassman reports on the major step towards getting Americans back on the moon's surface. For America, Artemis 1 reopens the vault of deep space. Back to the moon and beyond. Its irresistible force, NASA's most powerful rocket ever. Our irresistible object sailing among the stars to find our place in the universe. A new era, a NASA first. Artemis's female launch director, Charlie Blackwell Thompson. The harder the climb, the better the view. We showed the Space Coast tonight. What a beautiful view it is. Views like this. 57,000 miles away from the place we call home. Views about to get better. Come Monday morning, uncrewed Orion will fly within 60 miles of the lunar surface, then push on roughly 40,000 miles beyond the moon before heading home. We've got four weeks of mission to go. We are just barely starting to scratch the surface. Today, the moon again. Tomorrow, Mars. That's one small step for man. NASA's Apollo program of yesterday and its Artemis of today, as alike and as different as brother and sister. Mark Strassman, CBS News, Kennedy Space Center.